Alrighty, you scallywags. Welcome back to War Thunder. This is part two of the Centaura 120 stock grind. If you guys know, we left off at researching DM33 and getting the improved parts for the first episode. My plan is to get thermals and laser warning system. Now, ladies and gentlemen, before we do start the video, I do just want to say thank you guys so much for 1,000 subscribers. And speaking of subscribers, if you guys want to help me reach my new goal of 1,500 subscribers, by the end of the year feel free to do so i love all your support and i thank you guys so much for it so so without further ado let's continue to the video all right starting off with an actually decent map in my opinion anyways like i was saying i do think that this is a good map i mean it's a good map for literally anything it's fun it's got your perfect little i don't know i wouldn't say sniping a little fun area back here for long range shots and plenty of urban but it's like the perfect mix between urban and shall I Honestly, guys, for those that are watching, um, you guys think it'd be funny to see a video of, like, napalm bombing with that little, uh, where you, uh, drop napalm bombs on tanks and they kind of just, like, sporadically flip out? Also, I got a comment in a video. Watch it, Buster. I got a comment in a video saying that, um, the Type 90... B is a very good premium as well and for a while now I've been wanting to play it I just I I really don't want to spend my money just to buy it because I don't really want to grind Japanese tech tree but I want to play that so honestly that's one of the things that I'll wait till I I can apply for partnership for Gaijin and see if I can request it as a vehicle I'm gonna try my hardest to give good commentary um, and actually like deliver you guys some good content but yes we do have normandy which i sure am hoping that i can go around here and go help out um defending the point and hopefully uh scouting over some hills to give me some you know, points I forgot I had no laser rangefinder. <laughs> All right, well, did we get first strike? Aha! I did get first strike. That's awesome. So many, <laughs> so many enemies popped up at once. I don't know which one to hit. See, being that I'm uh, range finding this, it doesn't really help to know that I'm at 800, just because, as you guys can see, my sight, I can't really, like, gauge what my sight's at. Like, even when I, I'm trying to laser range find, even when I laser range find, it doesn't go up. So, I'm thinking about changing the sight. Like, I like how simplistic it is, but <laughs> it's got to change. Hopefully I can remember after this match. But yeah, like I said in the last video, um, four-person crew is nice because if it was a three-person crew, I'd be dead by right now. Okay, so sources say there was a guy over here. I don't know if he's still over here or not. Um, who all's alive? There's a guy right there, and there's a. Oh my gosh. No laser rangefinder. I did that all. All skill. Purely skill. I'm just. Uh, I'm too good at this game. Sign me up for esports. Oh crap. <laughs> but you know what? It's fine. I, I just shot a helicopter out of the sky. 
without the use of a rangefinder. Yeah, definitely sn sniping is definitely a weakness without this rangefinder. That's why I'm researching it before I get the thermals. There we go. Oh, oh, is that, what is that, Markava? Yeah. Oh, he's right. Don't move, don't move, don't move. Target's over there. Guess my paveway didn't didn't like where I was. Surely he's not shooting at me. Yeah, he's not. Direct hit. Let's go. Oh, there he is. And the mission's over. No. Over halfway there. Nice crack. Uh, I think I'm going to go to the right of the map just to see if I can go near the castle. Or possibly under the castle. Honestly, the Leopard 2A4M, it, it's a cool looking premium. One of the coolest in the game. It's definitely cooler than the Leopard 2A6 and 2A5, but I wouldn't say as cool as the um, Leopard 2A7. 2A7's gotta be the best looking Leopard of all time. If I were to rank them, I'd say the 2A7, the 2A4M, and then the regular 2A4. And then the 2A5, 2A6. <clears throat> I was hoping to shoot him in the butt before he went behind the wall, but, yeah. I know I mentioned this in the first video, but I love the looks of it. It's so cool. And the asymmetricness, just, I, f I feel like it being asymmetric look makes it look better. That's just my opinion. Like, if, and... Same for the Abrams. If the Abrams was actually symmetric, I don't know if I'd like it as much. Alright, so there's a guy right across from me. That's definitely alive. It is a wolf pack. It was... Oh, 2S38. And wolf pack! Okay, go shell. Is that clickbait alive? I can't tell. Okay, I'm, I think he's dead. You can get eyes. He's being pelted. No, 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 no. no. I don't know why he popped smoke. He was honestly at better chances of defending against me without smoke. Mm hmm. I was attempting to go after that guy that was peeking around the corner. Oh, also if you guys have actually made it this far. You guys are probably wondering what sound mod do I have. I'm currently using the IWSM7 sound mod, not the 8, because I downloaded it before the 8 came out. So I'm using the 7. But there might be some minor tweaks. Uh, the Abrams sound different, I know that. But overall, I'm pretty sure they're similar. But anyways, I mean, I am using IWSM. Immersive Warfare something sound mod. I think that's how it goes. But yes, I'm using that. And, um, I've been using it for like two months now. It's pretty good. I like it. Oh. Hey, 
there's that STRV 122A killed. Curious if I can peek over and see anybody else like that Abrams. So, so thankful that he was blind and did not see me. Yeah, see the oh crap 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 where is he where is he where is he I just got a double kill mm. that's great it just went right through the Abrams into the HSDVL and killed him what uh oh. whoa 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 Like I was about to say, I like how responsive the Centauro is, but it's more of the acceleration of this thing that makes me happy, and is why this thing's like really good. It just it, it feels better than the other Centauros. I don't know why. This guy right. Always look like looks like you're gonna be seeing a couple YouTube shorts from me as well. <laughs> Between me shooting the helicopter and then the, getting that double kill. Ah, oh, that was close. But this game is over. Very good game for my stock brand, though. I think, fingers crossed, um, I'll be able to get my laser rangefinder after this game. And. You know what I'll also do? I'll change my sights. Oh. Yep, told you. Got the laser warning system. Now that I have the laser range render, there's not really a need for it, so... Why did I do that? I don't know. By the way, leave, leave in, definitely leave in the comments. Do you guys like this? Um, or should I change it? Should I change it back? Should I change it to a different one? I'm always open for a different site. I am also always open to your guys' ideas. So, feel free to leave them in the comments. I think the, I think the composite screen plating is pretty cool as well. kind of like it. I wonder if the RGO has it. I'm gonna guess it does, just because the RGO is kind of like a beefier variant. War Thunder official channel should do a the Metal Beasts section for the Centaur RGO. Yeah, yeah, I know. See, the biggest thing that I'm fighting with right now is the gun depression. I kind of need to start paying more attention to the... <clears throat> oh my gosh. I hit that. Didn't get killed by him, nor his friend, little friend right here. I don't see anybody. I'm hoping he can scout him. Did he kill that leopard? Oh, that dude's all the way back in the spawn. I was... Generally confused. What do I hear? It is definitely probably my dream to average about, you know, one to two thousand views a video. I'm not exactly super worried about subscribers, but. Ooh. Ooh. 
Ladies and gentlemen, because of Golden Quarry, we've gotten night vision devices, or should I say thermals. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in part three of this video. Thank you.